How to become an English literature professor. An English literature professor teaches English language literature and related subjects at a college or university. In most cases, an English professor is also required to publish articles and write books about literature. To become an English literature professor, you will need to have a critical approach to literature, be able to communicate effectively, have the necessary post-secondary education and be willing to put in years of hard work and study, one, getting the necessary credentials. Complete an undergraduate degree in English literature or a related field. Though it will be more beneficial to have a degree in English literature, a degree in a related field or subject like comparative literature or creative writing can also move you forward in your career. You should maintain an excellent grade point average and do well overall in your undergraduate degree to appear more appealing to graduate schools. In some cases, you can teach English at the higher education level even if your undergraduate degree is in an unrelated field like fine art or engineering. However, you will need to able to demonstrate that you have a high level of expertise and writing ability in your applications to graduate English programs. In a bachelor's English literature program, you may cover subjects such as English literature, American literature, African American literature, postcolonial literature, Shakespeare, nonfiction, global literature, and contemporary novels and short stories. Apply for master's programs in English literature. To teach English literature at the college or university level as a professor, you will need to begin by completing your master's in English literature. Many master's programs are one to two years and require you to choose a sub-field of English literature that you would like to specialize in, for example, the 17th century novel, postcolonial literature, or American poetry. You will be required to produce a written dissertation, known as your master's thesis, on your chosen topic of specialization in order to graduate. During your master's degree, you should try to get more experience in the classroom as an instructor. If possible, you should apply for a teacher assistant TA position, which will allow you to work closely with an experienced professor and gain first-hand experience in a college classroom. Your responsibilities as TA may include organizing class materials, instructing students on small tasks, grading assignments, preparing exams, and lecturing on topics to the class. Your professor will give you expectations around how many hours a week you are expected to put into your TA position. 4. Complete an application for a PhD program in English literature. In your application, indicate your area of expertise, your readiness for doctoral research, and your past accomplishments in the field. Include examples of your work from your undergraduate or master's program. To complete the application for most programs, you will need to provide a statement of purpose, a CV or resume, letters of recommendation at least two for most programs, and a writing sample. A writing sample that showcases your best writing in essay or paper form is expected for the application. In a recent study done by an economist, data showed that getting a PhD from a top 10 ranked school can improve your chances of landing a position as an English literature professor. Though you may be able to find a position if you go to a lower ranked university for your PhD, you may end up working with undergraduates with weak academic backgrounds. Take this information into account when you are applying for PhD programs. 6. You should focus on coursework and expanding the scope of your reading during the first two years as a doctoral student. You should also try to secure a position as a teaching assistant or lecturer during the middle years of your doctoral program. Teaching experience is essential for becoming an English literature professor. Publish papers and other original research. You should try to do this as soon as possible, or at least by the second year of your degree. Having a record of publications and research will look good on your resume when you are applying for English literature teaching positions. Ideally, you will publish papers early in your PhD career and often. You should try to gear your seminar papers towards topics that you are interested in or have specialized knowledge in the subject. You can then revise them and submit them for publication in journals. To submit papers for publication, you should look on the website of the publication for the submission guidelines. Each publication will have their own guidelines to follow in order to submit your article for consideration. You can find a database of current English literature journals for submission here. Complete your dissertation. You will then need to complete a dissertation by the end of your sixth or seventh year in graduate school that demonstrates your mastery of your chosen sub-field, your ability to conduct original research, and your writing ability. Once you complete your dissertation, your degree will be complete and you can enter the workforce. 